Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another Stormworks video. Today we've actually got a tractor, we've got a trailer, and we've got a massive car transport ship. So, today we are going to be transporting the tractor and the trailer with the car transporting ship to Terminal Komodo, if we know where that is. Do we know where that is? Yeah, we do. We're literally just going to be taking it next door, and we're going to be... Actually, should we try and take it to here instead? Let's take it to the multiplayer island, and um, we'll try and drop it off, and then we might do a lap. I don't know. That seems like a good idea to me. Anyway, uh, we're going to go ahead and jump inside the tractor. We're going to attach it to the trailer. And then we're going to drive it up onto the ship, and then hopefully everything will go well. Um, we are, of course, in slow motion because the ship is huge. And, um, yeah. I don't know. Let's see how this goes. Hey! Alright, so, as it stands, this tractor doesn't actually have any doors. Uh, so you can actually just get inside like so. Uh, and that's really easy. We got the engine right here, so let's turn that on. Uh, we got the lifter at the back, which we are going to lower down. Uh, it's this thing. It's the, the three-point hitch. Uh, if we go ahead and we lower that down, we should be able to attach to the trailer without getting out, uh, which would be perfect. If we press two, we're in reverse. And if we press six, the handbrake turns off. And in theory, we should go backwards. Oh, yeah, look at how slow this is. Uh, we're in slow motion, so this tractor's faster than this. Uh, it's just because that ship's there, we have to go slower. Anyway, uh, this is working fine. This is working completely fine. There we go, we're attached. That was easy. All right, cool. So press two again. Press six. And we should be able to start driving forwards. Beautiful. All right, so before we actually take it onto the boat, if we go ahead and we press one... Uh, it disconnects some things on the trailer, and if we do this, it should lift it up in some sort of way. Uh, I think. I think. I think. Is it happening? Hold on, I've pressed one, two, three. I wonder if I have to be still to actually activate those. Oh, no, there it goes. Yeah, so you can tip it backwards. Uh, the back door actually opens. That's pretty epic. Uh, so if we want to lower that back down, we just put it back to zero. I think. Yes. Alright, two. Where's one? Come on, go back to zero. There we go, zero. So that's back on the deck. If we now press this, uh, it actually connects itself again, hopefully. Um, and then essentially, you can just tip it sideways, or you can tip it the other way, uh, which is epic. That's actually pretty cool. Anyway, we're getting on top of that thing today. Oh, it's going to be great. Okay, so I just tapped out to try and figure out what its name was. Uh, apparently, it's called the Nordic Leader. Also, this is a Fendit. Fendit. I don't know how you pronounce that. There's like, I don't know, the DT in the end just doesn't seem right. Uh, and the trailer itself, I can't remember what it's called. But they will all be linked down below, so don't worry about it. Anyway, here we go. I, I don't even know if we fit. <laughs> we might fit inside. We also might not fit inside. I'm going to go ahead and turn the low beams on, because at the moment it's getting a bit dark. Uh, can we turn the work light on? I think that's this thing on the top, but I don't think it works. I mean, it, it isn't a light, so it doesn't make sense. Anyway, uh, we're going. This is fine. This is fantastic. Uh, enable pass-through. I don't know what that means. Um, yeah. All right. Well, we'll just keep driving, and hopefully we fit. <laughs> um, there's a ramp on the side. This isn't naturally down. You have to do this yourself, uh, and you control it from up there. So as soon as we're on the ship, we need to get up to there, and then we can close the door. And we'll just have a tractor inside with a trailer. It's going to be epic. All right, we've mounted the ship. We're going inside. Here we go. Yes. Yeah. Wait, we fit like perfectly. Oh, look at this. That is great. So I think the bigger vehicles go downstairs and the, the smaller vehicles go upstairs. So we are a bigger vehicle, I think. We're going to leave this on the bottom and everything's going to be fine, I'm sure. Yes. Oh, look at that. All right, we'll park this somewhere down here. Um, the trailer has its own brakes, so if we press 6, it should stop. The trailer's got its own brakes, so that, that should stop too. And if we get outside, we can just leave this here. I'm going to turn the lights off too. Let me, uh, let me do that, please. There we go. Low beams off. Beautiful. Yeah. All right, so now I'm going to show you guys how to actually close the gate. I meant to say ramp. It's a ramp, not a gate. Well, this is a door, but, uh, well, yeah. Words. I don't do words. Anyway, <laughs> let's go upstairs. Here we go. Yes. Uh, we're going to go upstairs again. Come on. Here we go. Up the ladder. 
Perfect. Uh, and then just around... Oh, this is the top deck, by the way. This is what it looks like. So if you have a bunch of cars that you want to transport, just drive up here. It's amazing. Uh, then you go through this door. And all you have to do is press up. We're going to close the door. We're going to seal the door. And that's epic. So let's have a little look from the side how this works. That door closes. Like so. And it locks into place. So uh, I guess we don't sink. That makes sense. Uh, the door folds in half. These are real ships, by the way. This is a real ship. Well, I don't know whether this is a real ship itself, but these these ships do exist. Um, I think we might have broken it. I think we might have broken it, maybe a little bit. Uh, but essentially, as soon as these, these wires get uh, tight, maybe it'll pull itself in. I don't know. I've never actually closed it before. Okay, no. So I think we actually have to move the, uh, move the thing uh, real quick. For it to actually come up. Oh no, here it goes. Here it goes. We just press the button again and it starts coming up again. Oh, there is a bit of an issue. Okay, hold on. If you do it again, then it should start folding. Uh, so there is a bit of an issue where if you press these buttons too much, uh, essentially what happens is the hinges right here get confused and it would have been straight up and the ramp would have been <laughs> straight up in the air. But if you press it again, it folds back down, which is amazing. Um, I don't know what's going on here. It's, it's unfolding itself. Come on, winches, pull it in. You got this. Yes, there we go. Oh, yeah. That is epic. How cool is that, though? Anyway, we need to run to the front of the ship now uh, in order to actually um, drive it. We need to drive it. Okie dokie. So I'm assuming somewhere somewhere down here that we, we can actually get up to the bridge. So uh, if we go inside here, bum, 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 get inside, yes. Uh, what is in here? So... We've got a bunch of rooms. Oh, it's the same again. It's the same cabin. I see. All right, okay. So if you've watched my previous videos, you'll probably remember this, actually. There's a normal room in there. There's a computer on it. If we go downstairs and behind us should be the galley, like the food area. And yeah, it is. All right, and then inside here, we've got a bunch of rooms, which indeed we do. Okay, right. So these are like copy pasters. That's interesting. That is... Very interesting. I suppose it works, though. I mean, it's a good design, so... Might as well keep it the way it is. Um, let's go ahead and turn this on. Radar. Beautiful. Let's go ahead and turn on this. Uh, radar system power. Sure. And then if we go to the very front... We just need to get it moving. Um, but it's the same bridge we've always used. So we should just start moving. Yeah. If we press uh, one horn... Does it not actually have... Do not have engines? Interesting. All right, are we moving? Yeah, we are. Oh, this thing is slow. I'm glad we're not going too far away. We're literally going over there. <laughs> so, yeah. This is going to take its time, I think. Oh, wait, 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 wait. You might remember this from the previous video. Look at this. Yes. Oh, no, this is different. This is actually a different... Is it? Is this a different thing? I don't know. Um, But essentially, these blew up last time. Uh, if you guys remember. They, they exploded. So, um... Yes. <laughs> okay, so I actually have a feeling that we're doing this slightly wrong. Um, when I say I have a feeling, hold on, let me do uh, set normal. There we go. That turns on all the lights that you need. Anyway, we need to find a way down to the bottom of the ship to turn on the generators. So if we keep going down here, I'm assuming the engines are in... Oh, wait, how do we get down? How do we get all the way to the bottom? Oh, here's the stairs. Yes. So I think we need to go... Oh, I don't know where to go. I don't know which way it is. Let me have a little look. Here we go. Whee! All right, where are these engines at? Are they through the front? No. Okay, these are... No, no. There's our tratter. Oh, here's the engine. All the way at the back. Okay, so we need to find a way to get down here. Interesting. All right, there we go. So this is the engine room. All of these are actually already on. And to turn the main engine on, I can't remember. <laughs> um, I remember it seemingly being one of these things, but actually, I don't know. Uh, we've got the stability things. So we've actually got um, bilges and stuff. Uh, it says that we should fill them up uh, for loading and unloading. So we haven't actually done that, but um, yeah. Oh, here it is. Okay, bilge pumps. We can turn them on there. Start main engine. Yes. Okay, good. Uh, we have to come outside here. and We have to start these things up as well. Yeah, okay, right. So, do this. Yes. Three and four. Quick charge. I guess that's working. I don't really know. 
Are we going to do the same thing on this one? Here we go. Do, 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 do. Quick charge. Turn it on. There we go. I think we're good now. Yeah. All right. Go back in here. Make sure the engine is still running. Yeah, it was. There we go. All right. And now we can just go upstairs. Beautiful. All right. So we're back in the bridge. I'm assuming that we're going to go a little faster than we were earlier. Um, I'm hoping so at least anyway, because we were going slow. Yeah, we are. We're going a lot faster now. Um, so essentially, we just gotta get around to the multiplayer island and have fun uh, unloading, I guess. Yeah. I figured we might as well test it out against the waves as well. And um, it isn't like, it isn't very fat. It's quite skinny, actually. Um, but it actually appears to be completely, I was saying completely fine. It does get pushed over a bit, but I don't think it'll tip over fully. Which is very, very nice, I suppose. Uh, we also have a crane back here in case we need it. Um, so that's good. <laughs> I actually wonder how the uh, how the thing's getting on the uh, the tractor. Let's go downstairs and have a quick little peek. A quick little peek at the tractor. Um, I, we are currently sort of going towards an island, so I need to be quick. Uh, the tractor hasn't moved. The tractor actually hasn't moved. That's that's very good. That's very, very good. Yes. Yes. All right, let's get back upstairs then. Um, this is quite annoying because uh, realistically, I need to sort of like aim fully left and then aim fully right so that we can reverse backwards uh, onto the dock, which is going to take quite a long time. But... Um, that should be fine, I guess. We, we might be able to do this quite quickly, hopefully. I don't know. All right, it turns out I've done a bit of a boo-boo. Um, uh, there is very, very dark smoke coming out of the chimney. The chimney, the funnels, the smokestacks. The, there's dark smoke coming out anyway. Um, and that's not good. <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know why that happened, but we have exploded. So, um, yeah. <laughs> Um, I don't know whether it's quite on fire, but like we, yeah, it is on fire. We are on fire. I don't know. How? <laughs> I don't know how that's happened. Anyway, we're going to go full reverse right now. Oh, that's no way. Point 10? Really? Oh, this is going to take forever to go backwards. Why are we beeping? Why is it beeping? What is happening? Oh, that's not even in game. That's real life. We're on fire. Help. Okay, well, that was interesting. I don't know what's just happened in real life, but, like, the alarm just started going off. I'm in here. This doesn't make any sense. Anyway, uh, <laughs> the fire's coming out the bottom. Um, we need to reverse all the way back to there. And, unfortunately, we're going to be doing that at zero miles an hour. Uh, uh, how do I turn it? Oh, wait. Can I go turn the engine into reverse? I don't know how this works. I have no idea how this works. Should we try that? I'm going to go back and turn it into reverse. Hopefully that'll allow us to actually go backwards. I don't know. Oh, we kind of have to walk through fire to actually get there, but that's okay. Also, I'm going to have to reverse that out, <laughs> oh, which isn't good, but whatever. Uh, oh, no. Oh, no. We have to actually go down to the fire. A hot diggity dog. Ow, I'm dying. Oh, my. <laughs> it's very on fire. Uh, right. Press the reverse button. There we go. Go back upstairs. Is there something that I can do down here to fix this? Arm fire suppression system? Yeah, here we go. Here we go. Put out that fire, please. Wait, I've got fire equipment gear here. Yes. All right, get in there. Dude, the fire suppression system isn't really doing anything. I'm still dying. All right, well, we're going to leave that doing whatever it's doing. We're just going to pretend that it's not happening. And uh, we're going to reverse up to the dock to get the tractor off. Because the tractor is the most important thing in the world. Okay, so if I throttle up now, now that we're actually in reverse, are we going to go backwards? Or are we still going to go forwards? I think we're still going forwards, you know. Yeah, I don't think I'm actually going to be able to go to the uh, to the dock. So, um, what we might have to do is just unload here, uh, which is obviously dangerous and stupid and all, but whatever. Uh, we're going to go ahead and do this, uh, if I can. Can I just let this go? Is that a thing? Can we try and let this go? Um, 
Do 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 do. Pump it. Oh no. Okay. Yeah. You have to pump it. That is not something we can do and then get off. That's that's not something we can do. But we do have lights, so that's nice. Um, right. Okay. Yeah. The reverse situation. I don't think is gonna happen. So I'm not entirely sure what I should do here. Like we're going like not point not something, and that's just like. Like we're not moving. Yeah. Uh. Hmm. Okay. I've spawned in the tsunami <laughs> because I want to see what the ship does. Um. I don't know why it burst into flames. So that's an interesting situation. And I don't know how to actually reverse it. But before the tsunami actually gets here, I want to open up this door. I want to lower the ramp. And I want to attempt to at least drive the tractor out. Um. And hopefully that is something that might be good. <laughs> I don't know, um, but here we go. This is what you what you do when you test things, right? You just break things by accident. Anyway, ramp down, seal door, open door. Uh, and that should open itself, I think. Is it opening? Yeah, it is. Alright, cool, awesome. So that's going to fall down, that's going to be good. We need to go get in the tractor and turn it around. Or reverse it out, but that's not going to happen. There's no way we're reversing it out of there. No way. Alright, um, let's quickly get inside then. Here we go. Yep, get inside. Press 6. Uh, go ahead and start the engine. Uh, there we go. Okay, we've started the engine. We're in first gear. We're going to try and turn it around. All the way around in here. Dude, do we have enough room to just keep going forward? No, we don't. We don't. Change gear. Reverse. We need to reverse. Here we go. Yes. Okay, right. Beautiful. That's good. Now forwards. Come on. Forwards. Yes. All right, perfect. We've, we've got more than enough room to turn around a tractor and its trailer and to drive out. Yeah. Look at this. How awesome is that? Yes. So just ignore the fact that I'm in firefighting equipment and ignore the fact that we're driving onto uh, nothing. Everything's fine. Oh, and the tsunami's behind us. Everything's fine. Uh, right, okay, well, I guess it can just save itself. We're gonna press 6, and it's probably gonna roll off, and I've just fallen off of the whole boat. That's not good. I don't know how you get back on. Oh, we can get on there. Alright, cool. Uh, tractor is... is... fallen over. Okay, tractor's fallen off. That's fine. Um... <laughs> R.I.P. Tractor and Trailer. Uh, they're very cool creations, though. You guys should check those out. Um, but we need to get back on the ship. It is important. Yes, it's very important. And I actually kind of feel like we need to get to the lifeboat, so we got to be quick here. we got to be very quick. I'm just going to run up the ramp. This is fine. Yes, the tsunami is almost here. we got to be very quick here. Keep jumping, keep jumping. Jumping usually helps. I'm pretty sure it usually helps anyway. Oh, the tsunami is here. It's already here. we got to be quicker. we got to get inside. Yep, we're good. Alright, the door on the back is open, so we might actually sink. Oh, that is actually a possibility here. Oh, I don't know what's going on. Right, what is... what's happening? Okay, we're at the top of it already. We're already at the top of it. Look at that. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Yep. Well, we've fallen over. Is that the anchor? Dude, the anchor looks amazing. Um, okay. We're still on fire. That's... that's not changed. Um, <laughs> but we survived. All right, nice. I want to actually use the, um, the lifeboat, though, for once. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to quickly jump out here. Yep, just ignore the tsunami. We survived it, though. That's good. Uh, we're going to get inside here. Yes. Close the door. Beautiful. Get inside the seat. Do this. Actually, wait. Engine system, beacon, launch flares. We don't want to do that. Wait, where's the power? It's back here, isn't it? Yeah, okay. Power, good. Do this. One. Okay. Two. Okay. And uh, three. I don't know whether that counts. And four. No, we have to keep going. We have to keep going. Hold on. Uh. Oh, there we go. There we go. Look at that. It slides out. Yes. Beautiful. Dude, isn't that epic? That's so cool. And splashdown! There we go! That is epic! Yes, now we should be able to just drive off. I think. Can we just drive away? Yeah, we can. Awesome! Yeah, well, see you later, car, car transporter. Uh, it was nice knowing you. But, um, you did... 
you did explode, so I'm not sure why that happened. But, um, see you later. Ciao. But, uh, yeah, I guess I don't really know what else to do. Um, we've, we've tested it. It didn't really reverse. We, we managed to use the ramp on the way in. That was really cool. Um, the car, the, well, the, the trailer and the tractor stayed exactly where they were supposed to, which is epic, even in the waves. And, uh, it survives a tsunami as well. So, yeah, I actually think it, it's a very good build, but I, I don't understand why it can't reverse. I, I don't get it. Anyway, um, <laughs> or why it exploded. I don't get that either. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And, um, yeah, I guess I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.